welcome everyone i hope you must stay safe and stay healthy so let's start today's fact today we are talking about what is an elevated hemidiaphragm elevated hemidiaphragm is a condition in which half of a patient's diaphragm appears to be raised or elevated it can be seen on a medical imaging study or upon surgical examination and it is an indicator of a serious health problem the treatment for elevated hemidiaphragm varies depending on what is causing the situation and may require input from several medical specialists who can combine forces to develop the most appropriate and effective treatment the diaphragm is a tough layer of tissue which plays a role in respiration and separates the thoracic creativity cavity from the abdominal cavity the tissue is diagnosed designed to move with respiration to accommodate the expansion and contraction of the chest which occurs when people breathe in and out problems with the diaphragm can inhibit respiration and cause other medical issues for parents there are three possible reasons for half of the diaphragm to appear raised or elevated something wrong with the diaphragm itself something going on in abdomen which is pushing the stuff sheet of tissue up into the chest or something occurring above the level of the diaphragm which is causing the diaphragm to float upwards one reason for elevated hemidiaphragm may be that a half of diaphragm has been paralyzed by nerve damage other reason is cancer if a cancer introduced into the diaphragm it can be pulled out of position patients with lung cancer are at particular risk for this as the lung are close to the diaphragm and it is easy for the cancer cells to make the lap to the diaphragm raised or elevated hemidiaphragm can also be caused by a build up of fluid in the abdomen a tumor a surgical complication or a size blow the diaphragm causes from above can include the collapse of a large lung or broken ribs which destabilized the structure of the rib cage and may pull the diaphragm out of position when a patient parents with elevated hemidiaphragm the first step is figuring out why the condition is occurring while keeping the patient comfortable if discomfort is being experienced medical imaging patient interviews and other diagnostic techniques can be used to learn more about the situation once a cause is identified it can be treated and in the process the elevated hemidiaphragm should be resolved as well treatment option can include surgery to drain cystes or remove tumors chemotherapy to shrink cancer and so forth so that's all for today goodbye everyone have a good day ahead